Good morning, North Montgomery High School. Welcome to Charger TV. I'm Brendan Young. And I'm Tyler Granson. Today, we will look at this week's top news story, the weather report for next week, our student spotlight of Jaden Thompson, and our Charger Sports. Then we will move on to our teacher feature with Mrs. Dieters, something fun, an update about community events, and this day in history. We have parent-teacher conferences on Wednesday the 9th and Thursday the 10th, which means an early dismissal on those days at 1.45 p.m. We're holding the fall fling on Friday, October 11th after the home football game. The party will run from the end of the game until 11 p.m. If you'd like to have a guest from another school, get a form from the office and turn it in by October 10th. Remember, this isn't a dress-up event, just wear casual clothes. The Charger Marching Band has been putting in hard work on their show for the past few weeks, and it was proven at the Isma Marching Band Festival on Saturday, September 28th, with their gold rating. A huge thank you to all of the talented students, dedicated staff, and supported parents who have helped make this achievement possible. You can see the Charger Marching Band perform the show during halftime of the home football game on October 11th. Our boys and girls swim team will have a call out on Wednesday, October 16th at 8 a.m. If you are interested but have a morning CTE, make sure to contact Coach Yeager for season information. Hike and Spike is coming up soon. On October 30th, all students are encouraged to play or come out and cheer their teams. Girls will play flag football and boys will play volleyball. Check your email for a link to sign up and get your t-shirt. The high school's choir concert is on Monday, October 14th, and the high school middle school band concert is Thursday, October 17th. Which of these teachers coach football? Option one, Lutz. Option two, Ireland. Option three, Harshbarger. Option four, Hodges. Hello Chargers, I'm Hunter Brown, and today we'll be interviewing Ms. Dieters with our teacher feature. All right, what is your name? Hi, I'm Miss Heidi Dieters. All right, and how long have you been teaching? Over 25 years. Mm. How long have you been coaching? I coached two years of middle school, I, excuse me, I coached one year of middle school swim, one year of middle school cross country, and now this year I'm coaching high school cross country. All right, that's really cool. Uh, and what is your favorite hobby? Being outdoors, especially hiking and backpacking. All right, how many siblings do you have? I have three brothers, Hans, Heinrich, and Charlie, and one sister, Erica. All right, uh, what is your favorite animal? Definitely the mountain gorilla. And if you have any advice to your past self, what would it be? Enjoy every single day. All right, thank you very much. There are limited editions of the 23-24 yearbook left. There's only 15 available, and you can buy them for $65 each for Mrs. Hinders in the room 410. Now we hand it over to Hannah and Abe with the teacher feature, and then we'll wander the halls again with Hannah and Leslie. Hi, I'm Quentin Nichols, and I'll be covering sports for today. Next week, JV Volleyball will be at Lebanon Home, Sheridan Away, and then at Sectionals. Varsity Football will be at Daniel Away, while JV Football will be away in Frankfurt. Cross Country will be at Sagamore Conference in Southmont. Southmont, okay, that's all for today. Now, back to the studio. Now for some community news. Oktoberfest is happening tomorrow, October 5th at Pike Place from 4 to 9 p.m. There'll be German food and games, so there's plenty to enjoy. Now to Tristan with, with lunch and Peyton with This Day in History. This week's an Orange Week, so on Monday we'll have Coney Dog with baked fries, baked beans, fresh oranges, and Cheez-Its. On Tuesday we're going to have chicken noodle soup with a warm roll, mashed potatoes, green beans, and mixed fruit. On Wednesday, we're going to have a patty sandwich with potato wedges, baby carrots, and applesauce. On Thursday, we're going to have a beef burrito with seasoned corn, refried beans, chips and salsa, and also chilled peaches. And finally, on Friday, we're going to have mozzarella sticks with marinara sauce, a romaine salad, steamed carrots, apple wedges, and for dessert, we will have a cookie. Thank you for joining me for my lunch segment, and always remember to thank your lunch ladies. They work hard every day to get you what you need. Hi Chargers, on this day in history, the space race began. The Soviet Union began the space age with its launch of Sputnik, the first satellite, on October 4th, 1957. The spacecraft, named after the Russian word for fellow traveler, was launched at 10.30 p.m. Russian time. That's it for me, Chargers. 
That's all for us at Charger TV today. Thanks for tuning in and see you next week on Charger TV.